Welcome back. This morning we're previewing an upcoming exhibit featuring living works of art grown right here in the 608. Josh Pryder is live at Ulbrich Botanical Gardens <laughs> this morning, hanging out with some bonsai trees. Hey there, Josh. Kind of hiding behind this one right here. Not much to hide behind. Hello there, guys. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> we're having too much fun here on a yes, Thursday morning. <laughs> hey, we're talking about the annual bonsai exhibit happening this weekend at Old Brick. We have this beautiful setup. Mary Ellis said with the Badger Bonsai Society is with us. You guys are super excited. You've been doing this for many, many years. I mean, this is a lot of unique right here. Well. We have been, and it's one of the things, uh, I've been 26 years, Ron's gonna be on the next segment, he's been 27, and basically, we have been working on these trees, and Ron's had them, some of these for all that, all those years. But the thing that I enjoy, always have, is our annual show. And that's when we get to talk to the public, explain, what we like about this, how to take care of them. Uh, we have one thing that we particularly like, and that's vote for your favorite tree. And the kids seem to love it. You know, they go walking around comparing trees, you'll hear them talking about them, and they will come back sometimes with two or three numbers because they can't decide. So that's an awfully fun thing about the show. What's pretty cool is, you know, you mentioned all the different trees. You're gonna have like 50 to 60 of them here this weekend, and they're all different. I mean, even the ones on the table, they all have their own story. Well, it, the ones on the table, uh, this is a conifer, and there'll be a lot of those in the show, different types of junipers, whatever. And then there's gonna be some flowering trees. And we have a kind of funny thing in the club, uh, because flowering trees, the public loves. And, you know, we do too, but they often will take first place in the voting. So we tease about the fact that maybe we should have a rule that we can't have no flowering, flowering trees. Because <laughs> yeah, right. we just kind of, it, they obviously bring our eye in right away, oh, right? Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. And you can have uh, flowering crabs, lilac, this is a honeysuckle. And so, you know, those are trees that Mother Nature provides, and if they pop right in time for the show, you can bring it in and everyone will love it. Oh, yeah, yeah. but it's one of those things, the timing like that, they can be gone. They can be gone, you know, yeah, so they can just be gone. So it's all about the timing. Yeah. So what's really cool, too, is you have a bunch of the accents here on the table. Talk a little bit about how they kind of go in with the bonsai itself. Yes, when you're going to uh, display a tree in a show, you're going to have it all nicely cleaned up, you know, the pot. The, you're gonna be taking wire off of it and put it on some stand, uh, a nice stand, and then have an accent. And the accent can be a plant or it can be an object that, you know, you just think looks nice with the tree. And the way the accent is usually placed is it goes with the curvature and the way that the tree is leaning. And so if the tree is leaning to this side, the accent will be on this side. So then it's supposed to almost like follow your eye all the way down to the accent. That's correct. That's really cool. Yep. Okay, so if people are interested, Saturday, Sunday here at Old Brick, uh, check out the show. Yes, and it's uh, 11 to 4, I'm sorry, 10 to 4, and a demo at 11 and a demo at 1.30. And the demonstrations are also really nice because there's no charge for any of this and the demos will be given by club members who have been working on trees for many, many years. And it's usually always a different tree, you know, some something really different that they'll bring to work on. Mm -hmm. Good stuff, Mary. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. If you want to learn more, you can go up to channel3000.com. Guys, again, free admission. Perfect way, I think, to send a Saturday or Sunday, guys. Come with the whole family. Boy, those setups are really technical, Josh. Isn't that something? Like, there is something, like, with the accent, like, the whole, you know, following the tree all the way down. Like, there's a lot of history and a lot of, uh, you know, just good stuff with the history of how these things work, guys. Very cool, Josh. Thanks so much for highlighting it. Don't forget to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. Reach out on social media. He'd love to hear from you. A lot of his ideas come from you. He's at Josh Brider TV or email him at in the 608 at wrctv.com.